Earth people, I will okay you to death. Welcome back to another video. Welcome back to my channel. As you guys can tell from the title, this is a little sit down, chit chat kind of video. I love these videos. So I can be bringing more of these to my channel. So today I can just talk about things that I will not be doing at this tender age I am as a grown adult. Yeah. So if you want to hear about the things I can't even say that I will not be doing for 2023. I will not be doing going forward forever and ever all men at this age so if you guys want to hear my thoughts and what are my goals and stuff that I not my goals my things that I will not be doing going forward stay tuned if you're new here hit that subscribe button and if you're not new here welcome back my beauties let's get into the video okay so first one is clubbing I am not clubbing. Don't invite me to go to no club. Do not invite me to go to no club. Do not invite me to anywhere where there's no seating. I need to sit down. My shoes to hurt my feet. I need to sit. I am not going anywhere where I have to stand. People sweating on me. People squishing on me. And people pushing me here and people pushing me there. And there's a lineup outside waiting to get into the club. No, I'm not. I'm not. No, I'm not doing it. Don't invite me. If there's no seating, I am not going. I'm sorry. I think I passed that stage now a long time ago. I haven't been in the club like forever. Yeah, don't invite me. Because I, mm -mm. I... I ain't going. I want to sit down. And I want to have a nice drink. And I want to enjoy myself. I want to hear myself talk. And I want to hear my thoughts. Even if I ain't talking, I want to hear my friends. Uh, I forgot squash and stuff. I ain't going. Don't invite me. Please and thank you. I'm not doing that. No, I'm not. Next thing, don't invite me to no hookah bar. I don't hookah. I don't vape. I don't smoke. Please do not invite me to no hookah bar. I can't even say this is something that... I am not doing at this tender age. I ain't doing it, period. I never used to do it. Why will it start now? I was invited more than once to come and go to a hookah bar. I ain't going to the hookah bar. First of all, there's nothing remotely to me, in my opinion. Calm down, people. If we're gonna just do it, we're gonna just do it. To me, in my opinion, that is nothing. There's nothing remotely healthy about doing that for my body, so I'm not doing it. So don't invite me to no hookah lounge. Don't invite me to no vape bar. I don't know what you ever just call it. Please don't invite me. Yeah. So I will not be doing that either. Okay. Next. I will not be putting up with anybody that's belayed going forward. No, and I'm serious because I find that I find that to be very disrespectful to people and disrespectful to me. If I realize that it's something that you constantly doing, you always late, and then when you get, you laugh, and like, oh my God, you know, I'm so sorry, I late. You know me, I always late. Uh-uh. You disrespectful. You have to have respect for other people's time. I don't deal with that. We are all adults. Let's plan. You know the plan. To meet at four, be there at four. Your girl can get at least a 4.10. But if I realize that you constantly a half an hour, 45 minutes to hour late all the time and then come in laughing and smiling and grinning and give me the arm. You know me, girl, obviously, no friend. It will not be that because I got things to do. We all grown. I think as adults, we understand that people got things to do and people got lives and there's something called respect for other people's time. And if you don't have respect for my time, friend, don't, if you know who's that person, like obviously, don't invite me anyway. Because you can, you can get it once or twice, but after the third time, I will not be going. Yeah? And you know what is annoying me? And I see it a lot on social media, especially the, on YouTube. Since it is do YouTube, even before I started doing YouTube, it's like it's a trend. When people say, oh, I'm going to get my nails done, like the vloggers and stuff. I'm going to get my nails done. I always late so you can bring she Starbucks. Cut it out. Because I just go to somebody, right? This new person I go to to get my nails and stuff done. And the girls be real annoyed. But the girl 
just want her business to be promoted and to be put out there so she don't say anything you know what i mean she want the exposure so she ain't saying nothing but then people walking in there with a, a big fenty latte half an hour late and smiling oh you can embrace your starbucks come on people have respect for other people time time is money cut it out be early what wrong with being early if you're stuck in traffic or something at 5 10 i will give you a 50 minute late fine but 30 minutes and 45 minutes and you home and enjoying that you know you got things to do plan ahead so for me and i tell them when people don't do that is invite me places or if i'm not planning to invite me anywhere if you're somebody that always late, don't invite me because I ain't going. No, I would not. No. I mean, you would not gel. Yeah? Yeah. I ain't doing that. Yeah, I ain't putting up with the boy lateness because you want the respect for my time. So, yeah, we ain't doing that. Next thing, sleepovers. Don't ever ask me to sleep at your house. We will have to be in a snowstorm, a hurricane. We will be probably at your house having drinks and stuff and everything shut down and it can leave. But no matter what time it is, Son Jean will be going home to sleep in my bed. I am not, no, no disrespect to your house, no disrespect to your whatever, but I prefer to go home. I want to go home. In my bed i get home yeah your girl going home so don't ask me till they come and you know don't worry about you can sit at night no your girl going home i don't care where i am i am going home it would have to be something so tragic that i can't drive uber shut down ttc ain't working something along those lines that i have to have to stay but your girl going home and you see from the crack of dawn where everything is lifted I go home. Don't ask me to stay for breakfast or anything like that. No disrespect. But your girl going home. I think I, I, yeah, I passed that. I probably had like what? A couple sleepovers or something in my lifetime. Yeah, but your girl going home. I think I passed that stage now. Yeah, so I will not be doing that. So don't invite me. Next thing for me is saying yes to a lot of things. I used to say yes to a lot of things to make people feel good, you know, just to to calm everything and make everything okay, putting yourself in a bad situation, not in a bad situation, an uncomfortable situation, because you saying yes to something that you don't want or saying yes to something that you don't want to do to make other people feel comfortable, I ain't doing that anymore. No, it's no. Point blank, period, no. I done saying yes to everything, done saying yes to anything I don't want to say yes to to make people feel better. You can be uncomfortable, sis, or Jen. I, I really don't care. That's what it is. I'm not saying yes to anything. On the flip side too, for me, next thing that I will be doing, not afraid to apologize. If I do something and I you bring it to my attention, because honestly, sometimes you do stuff and you don't know how it affected the other person. If I do something, you can't tell me, Sanji, da, 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 da. I ain't afraid to apologize. I ain't too shame. I ain't got too much pride. I will apologize to you. Point blank. I think that's... A form of maturity if you get to that point you do something wrong just apologize and keep it moving but on the other hand please tell me if i do something wrong so i'll be able to say well sorry you get me yeah next thing i will say is arguing with people i will okay you to death i'm not arguing with no human being ever again okay 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 and keep it moving yeah that's me because i ain't got time for that what why that like standing up arguing going back and forth back and forth i'm not doing that yeah i'm not doing that so i will okay you to death and then you will see my back turning and i will walk away i'm not having an argument with nobody at this tender age that i am i'm not yeah so, I don't want this video too too long so I can do another part two some other time so the last thing for me is winging it I ain't winging nothing I need a plan I need a plan tell me where we going what we doing how we supposed to dress what time yada, yada, yada. I need a plan I need to know 
what is going on with my life and what I will be doing. I'm not winging nothing. I ain't winging it. I take it past that stage. The stage of winging things are over and done for me. I am not winging it. It's either you can call me with a plan or don't call me. Don't let me go out. Okay, sure, what are we doing? Just wing it. <laughs> no, sweetie. I passed that stage. I'm not winging anything. Not me. That's just me. Other people like it. I used to do it when I was younger, but I'm not doing it now. Like, I need a plan. I need to know what's going on. I need the deets. Give me the details. Yeah. And last but not least, reservations. I will not be showing up to anywhere unless we have a reservation because I am not going to stand outside no restaurant or anything like that in a line waiting for waiting to get a seat. No, I ain't doing that. Let me make reservations so I can walk in there and have my seat ready and I can sit down and be comfortable. Because as I said earlier in the video, my feet hurt and I might be wearing heels. I'm not doing that. I'm not doing that. I think we passed the stage of standing outside restaurants and stuff. Like we grown. Make a reservation and I'll be there. If you ask me to go out, I was like, okay, so what time your reservation is? Oh, we don't have none? Child, I ain't going. I'm not going. That's just me. I ain't going. Yeah? That's it. So that's the end of the video. Just a little quick little chit chat video. I don't want it to be too, too long. So anything that you guys have on your mind that you guys will not be doing at your tender age of however or adulthood, put it in the comment section below. Let me talk about it. And probably some things too because I have a lot more stuff to talk about of things that I will not be doing. Yeah. And I love that. So that is the end of this video, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. Again, like, comment, and subscribe to your girl. Subscribe to the channel. Let's continue to grow the family. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye. We will never be fine.